If you've been following along this title from A to Z, I've shown you many different new features and cool ways that we can increase our productivity and, and make our daily lives and our workflow a little bit easier. Now I'm going to show you a new feature in InDesign, which further expands upon that ideal of making our lives easier when, we're, when we are working on a document. InDesign CS5 contains a new feature called New Document Window. Now, it's not what you think, like creating a new document. It, it essentially allows us to work within the same document that we're working on simultaneously, but with two views. So let's take a look at how that looks. What I want to do is come down under the Arrange menu and select New Window. Now, in a prior movie, I showed you how you can have two or three documents open at once, like you might be working on an OM, a postcard, and a brochure all at the same time, but what this allows us to do is work in the same document at the same time. So I'm going to show you a few tricks on how you can take advantage of this. And one of the things that you're going to want to do is try to use this two or three times and you will become hooked. Otherwise, you'll never get used to it, but trust me, this is a great feature. To, to have and to use on a day-to-day -day basis. So what I want to do is, now uh, here I'll just uh, hit Alt Control plus zero to fit that in the window. Okay, so I've got these in the window and I'm gonna minimize that. Let's go ahead and send our left window into preview mode and we do that by hitting the W key on our keyboard. So I've got one in preview mode and I've got the other one in regular mode that I want to work uh, within here. So one of the things that I can do, we see here that we have property name. Now what if I want to move this? And I'm just going to move this up to the top here. We can see when I move it, it actually makes a change in my preview window so I can see what this looks like in real time. Now I need a little bit more real estate here, so I'm going to hit the tab key to get rid of those and expand so I've got more room to work within. Now what if I want to use a certain image perhaps on this home page? Well if I want to click and drag, let's say this image, onto this page, I can do that and it just simply clones it from one side to the other, but the changes are taking place in real time. So I'm going to get back to my page here and scroll all the way up and there we can see our image and if I move this around this is going to happen in real time on our preview mode our preview image as well. So another quick efficient way that we can work within our documents at one time if we need to. Try this a couple of times and you will become hooked.